Hey guys, it's Emma Romano here. Um, I've had a few people contacting me today in regards to they just feel really down, they're starting new relationships, they've been on a high, they've been feeling fantastic, and next thing, yeah, and they just want to cry, they just want to hide, they just want to be in bed. And then they start shitting on themselves because, you know, they should know better, they've got mindset skills. I'm going to say something to you. When you're in a relationship, you cannot work on a relationship unless you're in a relationship. And when you're in a relationship, that other person will pull up a lot of triggers for you. They will be your mirror. They will be your mirror. So whatever you don't like in that partner, it's something you're doing as well. And it may not be other people, it might be to yourself. It's a trigger. And when we just want to cry and curl up and, you know, go to bed and not come out, you're actually completing old trauma cycles. But here's the key. When you stop the crying, get up and jump because the emotion is actually stuck in the, in the vagus nerve, which runs from the top of the brain right down a woman's cervix or a man's, I think, testicles. And it holds all the trauma and it goes on either side of the spine. And it sends all the messages to the body everywhere. It's really important, but it can actually hold trauma and hold shame and everything. But this is my big thing, right? This is where people fuck shit up. When you're going down or you're like, I don't know what's wrong with me. There's nothing wrong. I should feel better. You've shamed your growth. You're going through a growing pain. That's all. You're growing. Sometimes the pain, have you ever had that ache in your leg as a kid when you're going through, going through a growing pain? Like no one looked at you and said, you're an idiot. You've got growing pain. They were like, oh, darling, you know, it'll be okay. Here, mummy rub it, or dad, I'll rub it. Go have a bath. You know, I'll sit here and play with your hair. Why are you doing that with yourself? Why are you shaming yourself for going through a growing pain? Why are you shaming yourself for feeling an emotion that is so fucking beautiful that God gave us? God didn't make mistakes. Stop telling him that he did. It's okay because if you shame it, you fuck it up. You wallow in it. And you'll sit there and you'll be like, oh, and it'll go for fucking days and days and then you'll start freaking spiraling out of control. Stop it. It's okay. Sit there and say to yourself, thank God I have the lifestyle that I get to process this right now. And here's another fuck up as well. When you're, you go through this stuff, don't try and understand it. You will never understand it because it may not be yours. It might be imprinting from your mother's placenta or from your grandmother or your aunt or whatever it might be. It might be ancestral. It could be fucking anything. But stop trying to figure out what it is because you'll fuck it up. Because what you're doing then is your imagination will create something. Okay? You're imagining. You're trying to put the two and two together. And this is where there's something that was told to us. It's very, very little that needs to be pulled out of the vocabulary for children. You know when you're three or four or five and, I don't know, you draw on the, on the wall? Why did you do that? Have a think about that, young lady. So now I've got to think about my actions. I just did intuitively because I thought it was pretty and I was decorating the house. Now I've been shamed about it. Now I've got to think about my actions. I don't understand it. And I've got to guess what mum or dad are doing and I have got to alter my behavior and my feelings to make sure mum and dad are happy with me because that means safety. Big shit, right? Big shit. Stop trying to put the pieces together. Just allow it to push through. Allow it to push through because those emotions will only come up if your unconscious mind feels it's safe to let it go. It'll only come up then. So when those emotions come up, something I say to myself, oh, thank God, next level. I'm going to level up. Thank God. I don't need to know what it is. I don't need to sit there and go, was it my father or my... Who knows? Who cares? doesn't matter. Just let it go through. Hope that helps. I love you guys. Mwah.